Hi guys, how are you? So basically, uh, the last few months I've been busy with a few different designs on e-bikes, scooters, all those type of things. So, I've recently done uh, the moped scooter one, which can go about 60 km per hour, per hour and then an average speed of about 40. So then I have a motorcycle, a 250 higher song frame, which I want to use this on. Because currently, the motor alone does not really have enough torque to be able to pull the motorcycle. So it starts so very slow and does not pick up speed. So basically what I've done here is taken a car alternator, converted it into a VLDC motor by removing the regulators and all this stuff. You guys can get some more videos on the internet if you like to know how to do that. And then secondly, I've taken a starter of a car, not sure which car it is, but yeah. So that's the starter motor. Um, I removed this shaft from the armature. And I machined it down and modified it for it to be able to take the pulley. And um, on the inside there, I took a small piece of cover from my alternator just to make sure it's got dual bearings so the shaft cannot move around. And this side where the Bendix used to be, uh, basically took the Bendix shaft, took it out, copied the, the pattern on the inside so it can fit perfectly in between the bearings. And this side I just uh, extended it a bit longer with a bit of thread for me to be able to put my sprocket on. So basically, yeah, now when you turn it, it's uh, basically 4 to 1 ratio, so which means we'll be having a lot more torque. And just to ensure that it's got enough torque, I've also increased the torque a little bit there by having a little bit smaller pulley there and a little bit bigger one there. So as soon as I put it on the bike, then I'll give you guys an update, but hopefully it will all go well. Cheers.